Hi, welcome to Ikate's Crossing. Okay, today's reflection using the Universal Celtic Tarot. First card we have here is the Empress. Now the Empress can talk about fertility, but not necessarily pregnancy as in a baby, but maybe a birth of a project or an idea or a plan. Something comes into fruition. Something is being born into something new. It's about seeing the beauty around you. It's about taking care of oneself. Not always of others. It can be also about nurturing yourself as well. Here you've got Six of Cups. Six of Cups can talk about a sense of nostalgic past memories. Okay, so what's been going on in the past that's allowed you to sort of think about what's going on for the sense of um, moving into fruition. Memories of the past could be related to things that are being brought into fruition now. Okay, card number three is the Queen of Wands. Could be about nurturing a creative project, awakening one's own passion, you know, nurturing one's own passion. Um, being able to awaken to the possibility of um, things coming into fruition. So that's the Universal Celtic spread. So we have the Empress, Six of Cups, and Queen of Wands. For me, this is about something, a project coming into fruition, reminding ourselves that maybe we need to take care of ourselves because of what's happened in the past. <coughs> Sorry, excuse me. <coughs> because of past memories that could be affecting the way that we nurture ourselves. Maybe it's also about nurturing that passion, that ambition that we want within ourselves. Maybe it's about nurturing our own sensuality, our identity in who we are. So let's have a look at the Blessed Bee cards. Let's see what blessings. Oh, this one here is turned over. And we've got a blessing on your family. So it could be about a connection with your family at this time. It could be about making sure they are safe. They are doing what's necessary. And everything seems to be moving into the right direction with family. So let's look at the Fairy of the Forest. A Fairy Forest card. And here we've got Freya. Again, we've got that abundance, that pure abundance, that commitment to having that thing that come into fruition. And the second card is the Yule Server. It talks about rebirth. It talks about that joy, that feasting, that it feels like everything's sort of coming together. It really is that sense of renewal, rebirthing of energy so that as things come into fruition. So that's it from me for today's reflection. Take care and blessed be.